Hello Virgo, welcome to the channel. I hope you're all doing well and thank you for your likes, shares and subscribes. Now we have insecurities here. Now this can be your, your self-esteem or your confidence levels. It can be the little devil on your shoulder saying you're not good enough. It could be somebody making you feel inadequate here. This is an impartiality in life. This is about finding that balance. I'm more drawn to the pots of paint here. So really, people should not be passing an opinion on you or what you're doing to a point where it's causing you to feel insecure. We need to be around people that are impartial, that appreciate you, that accept you for who you are. Now, let's have a look and see what this is about. If this starts to resonate, please like, share and subscribe. The Ten of Swords. The Temperance card, again, a card of balance, Sagittarius energy, could be relevant. The Knight of Pentacles. The Ace of Swords. The Fool card, which is overall central energy here. The Three of Cups. The Ten of Cups. The Chariot, which is Cancer energy. And the Seven of Pentacles. Now, what we've got here is we've got the ending of disappointments and mental anguish. So this is a time here to put an end to whatever is making you feel secure, whether it be a person or an environment here, or self-doubt. There's been a lot of mental anxiety here. And what Spirit's saying is you've been through enough now. This, this is ending. Now, this could be time for you to speak up. It could be time for you to gather information. You've got been through enough now to get the clarity you need to know that you need to move away from this energy whatever's causing this mental anxiety in your life. Now, what Spirit's suggesting here is that you take a leap of faith forward. You start afresh. You start this brand new journey. You trust that you move yourself forward. Uh, trust your intuition, rather, to move yourself forward, and you trust in Spirit to guide you here. This is a brand new start you're taking. So, like I say, you might be looking at things here to start brand new, to come away from the mental anxieties, whether it be an environment, it also could be you standing up for yourself or realising now that you're not going to put up with anything else or any more of what you've been in. Or it could be you having that faith to just take that plunge forward towards something that you've been wanting to do, a major idea that you've been wanting to take up here. In other words, you're not overthinking it, you're going for it. Now, this brand new journey is definitely going to move you forward. You're moving forward, for, you're not feeling insecure about things, you're moving away from people and environments that have caused these insecurities within you. You're moving forward quite quickly because you're prepared to open yourself up and trust and take that leap of faith forward towards the new enterprise or act on the idea or the information that you've gathered. And there's no reins on this chariot because you know exactly where you want to go. Now this is going to bring, you know, it's going to move you forward, definitely. It's a slow process though. So you might want to take time, like I say, to gather the information. You might want to go to new jobs. You might want to take up study courses. You might want to speak to someone here that could give you good advice. This could also be an opportunity coming to you because you're prepared to look to new things. It could be a Virgo, Taurus or Capricorn energy that brings you a more stable opportunity where you're going to be happier. Now, if you're signing contracts or anything legal here, then dot your I's and stroke your T's. Make sure you know what you're signing up for. But this really is about researching. It's about looking at new opportunities where you feel you'll find that balance that will suit you better in life. And this could be to do with how you're dealing with your finances, what you're investing your money into, where you're working, your relationships, or any kind of environment here. When you go forward here and you take your time, through time you're going to be able to build something more secure for yourself, where you're feeling secure within yourself. So like I say, a better financial situation, better job, a better relationship, a better environment where you feel more at home and you can work on things. And through time and patience, you will see progress being made. The situation in you just now, you're feeling insecure and there's more mental anxiety than progress being made. So what happens here is you go forward to new blessings. Now, this is blessings after emotional challenges. There is a light at the end of this tunnel. But you have to trust in faith that you have the and have the strength to go forward, to start afresh and start something new. This is lightening your life up. There'll be a childlike joy. There's a playfulness. There can be nights out here. Go and do something you enjoy. Spend time with people that you know you can trust. 
have a good time. It's time to have a good time. Because if you're prepared to take that leap of faith forward and move forward to new things, you're going to be able to create more harmonious environments, situations, relationships around you here that you're going to feel content in. And like I said, this is another card of patience. There's three cards of patience. The six, uh, the, sorry, the seven of pentacles, the knight of pentacles, and this major arcana card, which is a temperance card. You will find you'll be able to create that harmony through time. It takes time to find that emotional balance. Your mental anxieties will go. You'll create beautiful harmony around you. You've got to trust and believe and have the faith to take that leap forward away from whatever is causing the insecurities. Goals. Goals. It's time for you to take your goals off the back burner and go after them. So if there's any ideas, look into them. Move forward. Have faith. Balance. It's time to find balance in your life. What is most important to you? Absolutely. Find harmony. Create harmony. You deserve the best. You don't deserve to be in an environment where you're not feeling secure. I hope this helps. Please like, share and subscribe and I'll see you again soon. Bye-bye.